Hello, and thanks again for joining us as we share our home improvement experiences with you. We are going to bring our zombie couch back to life for only $8. This is a pretty easy project using foam we bought from Walmart. We're going to add it to our fixed sofa cushions. Fixed sofa cushions are sewn to the sofa and cannot be removed. If your couch looks anything like ours, watch how easy it is to bring it back to life. Here is a snapshot of our project before and after. First, we tip the couch on its front side so we can work underneath. Begin by removing the nylon cambric fabric. Ours was stapled way too many times to pull out each staple, so we cut the black fabric away from the bottom of the couch just inside the staples. Cambric fabric is used to cover the underside of furniture to prevent dust and loose stuffing from falling onto the floor. It serves as a dust cover and is made of non-woven black nylon. Here you can see the problem, old foam. It's even cutting into the springs in a number of spots. We didn't remove the old foam because it was glued to the seat fabric on the fixed cushion. Instead, we took two of our new foam squares and worked them between the springs and the old foam. Keep working through and be patient. Since the back cushions needed no extra foam, we aim to bring this new foam towards the front of our couch. This is why you see the foam placed towards the lower part of this picture. From this point, you can tip the couch back to its upright position. If you like the way it looks, you can either replace and staple new cambric fabric in or leave it for now. Live with it for a while and see if it's comfortable enough. You can add extra foam later if you'd like. As always, thank you for supporting our efforts by staying tuned in. If you haven't yet subscribed, simply click on the circle here and we'll continue to share projects you can do yourself. You can do it. Have confidence and make it fun.